Welcome to tonight's show. You're Tom Brown and Steve, and this is NRL from the sidelines. And as we do it every time this week, we're going to talk about the round of NRL that's just been played and to be played. Was mm-hmm. was, was football on this weekend? No, Didn't you notice weekend. it? <laughs> no, did it no. just slip your mind? Did it slip my mind entirely? With Why did tipping? it slip your mind, Brian? I thought the season finished about six weeks ago. <laughs> For you, it did. <laughs> For everybody else. Now. Steven. A few weeks, a few months ago, we had an agreement. I won't call it a bet because we don't agree with betting, <clears throat> but we had an agreement that 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 whoever finishes less on the table, the other would wear. Sorry, whoever they finished. would wear the winner's jersey. Yes. Six weeks ago, when you stopped playing, <laughs> yeah, South have steadily increased over Manly, and so it is incumbent on you to wear the South jersey. Everybody has been calling for the South jersey, and everyone's been calling for you to wear the retro jersey. But there was one good person who voted, please let him off, he's, he's suffered enough. <laughs> yes, but that was you. <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> that was you. It yeah. doesn't care. But I'm going to give you an out, because I'm a nice guy, as all Rabbitohs supporters are. Oh. Unlike Rooster supporters, we are nice, we are gentle, we are considerate, we are compassionate. I'm Delusional, gonna, too. I'm going to give you an out. I want you to pull out your wallet and take out $50. He's got it, trust me. Oh, he does have it too. $50. Okay, put it on the table. Okay, here's the deal. You can either put this jersey on for the show. It's done, it's dusted in, I don't know, half an hour, however long we talk for. However long I can stretch this out for, having you in a South jersey. Or you can donate that $50 to a charity of your choosing. Oh, come on. That's harsh. What's harsh about it? Well, I lost the bet, so I feel like I have to be defiled. <laughs> well, you can do... Hey, listen, Put it on. The, the last, the last, it over your shoulders. The last thing I'm going to do is defile you in any way. So let's get that straight. Can we, right can we compromise here? Instead of him having to wear the jersey, can he actually sort of drape it no, around his shoulders? No, he's got to put on. No, 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 he's got to put on. Because you won't see it draped around his shoulders. You won't, you won't see his back. What about putting it on here? The jersey or the donation? Your call. Look at the camera. Tell people what you're going to choose. I'm going to choose. I'm going to, I'm going to choose. Oh, my stomach hurts. <laughs> this is a really short show, by the way. Yeah, yeah okay. we don't have this much time, you know. I'm going to choose to do both, Steve, because yeah, I will honour my, honour my, 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 wager. my wager. Okay. Wow. So... Would you like me to pause the show while you put this on, or are you going to do a strip tease in front of everybody? Uh, isn't it next week? No, no, let's do it. <laughs> let's get it out of the way. You know what? It's like ripping off a Band-Aid. Let's just do it. But I had like I had like missing teeth and a, and a Sam Burgess mask to wear. I looked at home. We're doing it tonight, not next week. <laughs> <sighs> are you going to put that on over the top, are you? I, I can't touch it, so... <laughs> Oh, this is like you feel dirty now. I do, yeah, soiled. <laughs> Absolutely. Oh, oh my goodness. Oh. Oh. Can, I get a, can I get a photo? It's, oh, you can take oh, stills. Oh, it's, still, oh, yeah, it's still, touching me. You can take stills off um, off YouTube, can't you? Oh, I can. I can take stills off anything. Actually, I probably need my camera. Oh my goodness. Oh, look at that. Oh, that is spectacular. That's so you, that's you, so you Brian. <laughs> <laughs> my heart bleeds, Marona. Oh. That is absolutely spectacular. I, I can't look down because I see my hands. <laughs> well, I've, I've got to give it to you, Brian. That's courage. Oh, it's just That's oh, it's so dirty. I couldn't do it. So dirty. Come on, let's get on with the show. Okay, please. we're going to get on with finish. the show. We hope you Please let that. it finish, please. <laughs> so, so now you want the show to end in five minutes. Oh, oh I, I excuse keep... me a minute. <laughs> Thanks. Okay, here we go. Good now. I, I keep looking down and seeing this. <laughs> Now let me say this will oh. never this bet or this agreement will never be happening again because I don't ever want to lose it. Like heck, <laughs> no, it will. Let's go into the Eels. Fifty three defeated the Broncos six. Yeah, what do you say? Jeez. Oh, how bad were the Broncos? <laughs> Actually, while you're in that can... jersey, you can say how good were the Eels. No, I can't. <laughs> no, because because deep down my core is still maroon and white. Uh, oh dear! Oh, I was gonna know that this was this was a this was a bit of a masterclass by the Eels. Mm. There they was they, they they did they did 
everything right. Keep going. Mm. I just got to come back. Oh, he's gone. Oh, watch this. Watch, watch this when he goes. Watch this. <laughs> he didn't take his eyes off me. It was a bit of a masterclass by the Eels. It was. I don't know. I mean, the Broncos have been going from... Actually, surprisingly, since they beat Manly, they've been going worse. <laughs> uh, yeah. I don't know. I oh, don't do that. He's taking a picture of me. Get out of it. Um, I um, I I thought Moses had an exceptional game, and and when he when he's on, they're good. You know, yeah. Gutherson was yeah. was tremendous. He he's had he's had a super season. Seriously, um, uh, I, I so funny. So yeah, they're, they're just so on. Funny. They're just on at the moment. And yeah. look, I I think but, what remains to be seen is what happens this week. Because I think if they if they mm. play really well this week, I reckon they're on for this on for this, the finals. Yeah, I, I'm still not convinced. I mean, they 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 were on the week before, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. but they didn't have a lot of competition the week before mm-hmm. or this week or this week. The Broncos have been so bad the last two weeks. Yep. Nobody would have thought, even with the Broncos of last year, no one would have thought they would have lost by sixty and then lost by fifty three the straight the week after. At home. At home. There was no bounce back. Usually the team puts in an effort the week after. There was nothing like yeah. that. And all. what, you know, so Kevy's come out and said, you know, you guys are soft. And apparently they're all having a dummy spit and saying, oh, he's too hard. And I'd, yeah. and I'd take their contracts, I'd tear them up and say, well, I'm too yeah. soft. If you're that soft, see you later. Mm. That's unbelievable. Like, yeah. That, that scoreline yeah. just, it just, it surprised me. Yeah. Yeah. But right. look, I, I think. But you know what, Parramatta were, I mean, for. The night, the the opposition that they had, they were good. They were on. Yeah. They were on. Right, so yeah, sure. Okay, let's go to Panthers forty six, Warriors twelve. I mean, this was a foregone Training conclusion, run. I think. Yeah. You know, the Warriors didn't yeah. throw a lot at them. I think the Warriors are just happy to see the season end. And what they're doing without, you know, well, they they had Lewis uh, back, Lua didn't back. They? No, yeah, he was he was pretty but, good. Yeah, and Yo, I think was back. Uh, they, he he wasn't out. I don't think. No, I think Yo was out. Talking um, about Fisher Harris, sorry, and the other yeah, Fisher thing. Harris yes. was back. Yeah, yeah, they're good, they're very, yeah. very good, and they'll be hard to beat. You know, once they get all their troops back, they'll be hard to Absolutely. beat. Absolutely, yeah. I mean, not the worries of putting, putting, you know, not offering a lot, but um, Panthers did what they had to do and they did it in style, yeah, yeah. And they're, they're big, they're big names, uh, fired as well. Like Toho was excellent, yeah. Um, what are you doing? No, no, I'm not taking a photo. Just, I'm just doing things. I'm the organizer. He's the, the, the organizer. The, 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 the person here. Oh, yeah. oh, my ears are hurting. Mm. So, anyway, Panthers were good. Let's move on. Why, why do you hate the Panthers so much? I don't. I don't. I mean, what's because there to say? Because he wants to get to they're the good. next one. Now, what, well, it wouldn't matter what was then. That was enough. We talked about Panthers. What can you say? They're good. You know, they'll be hard to beat for the whole thing. I, you know, I'm not. Dis- let's let's all right. Well, let's move on to the next game, yep. which which oh, he's sending a message. He's sending that. He's sending the picture to someone. No, I'm not. No, no. That sorry. That um. This next game, I, I want Tom to go first, and then for you and I to actually tell okay. him how it was. To talk about the yeah, go. yeah, go. All right, go, Tom. Um, I thought it was a great game. I thought um, it was a great defensive game from both teams. Yeah. Um, uh, I think I, I've made notes here about. All of the things that Melbourne got away with that um, they shouldn't have, and like, I'll say it out, out front, um, Jared was Jared was was tough, and he was defending his team. He got sin binned, which I thought was lopsided consider, considering what hap- what happened no, in that in that we'll melee. Talk about it. That's all right. Um, so twelve minutes in, Munster uh, right arm across Radley's face, pen- penalty only. Any other time that would have been sin bin at the very least, and probably two weeks. Yep. Um, Nelson gets warned. Then nothing. Uh, Nelson gets warned. Then nothing after uh, for for a similar offence uh, on uh, I think uh, on Su Ali. Uh, Jared gets boned. Jared gets binned for virtually nothing. I thought um, he, he basically put his hand across his face, but he'd been warned, and and so he had to cop it. Fair enough. Fifty fourth minute. Hughes makes a break. Passes to Munster, who gets up, elbows Walker. Nothing. No penalty. Ridiculous. Fifty seventh minute. Um, so Uwa, so Uwa, 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 um scores. Marion Sevi leads with his foot, virtually touches his face with it. Nothing, not a thing. Um, and Munster gets a warning letter. Uh, so then Nelson rams his elbow into Crichton. That, that's what I was talking about before. Um, 
Uh, Munster gets a warning letter, nothing else. Okay. This but, is an absolute joke. Okay, but what you haven't done is, is, yep. is you also haven't then taken the other side and said what the Roosters did in response to all that. Now, yep. I, I get your point about yep. we're a high graves, but take you back 20 seconds before that. The mm-hmm. ref said, line he did. in the sand, he did. no more, yep. no yep. more rubbish. So I'll cop so, that. No, I'll, no, I'll cop no, that. So, That's so, fine. So I'll cop there it. was nothing wrong with the tackle until yep. he drove his head into his head. So I'll, I'll cop that. Okay. I, I'm, I'm completely okay with that. Um, I thought it was a bit soft to put to send him to the bin, but he'd no, already he said. But he said, you're mean. right. So I'll cop that. But there are a number of other other instances where where Melbourne did not get any any attention for the it, stuff it, that they it, did. On, honestly, it went both ways. Uh, and, and I was watch I was yeah. watching it. It went both ways. Yeah. That that I'd agree with. I, yeah. I thought I thought that was just a niggle fest. It was, and they were both doing it. Yep, they truly were. Yep. Anyway, I, I didn't think I didn't think one one side was worse than the others. Except, I'll I'll state it right now. Big Nelson, mate, for a giant of a man, he is Picks just on all the little blokes. I just no, I, they all do it. No, 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 no. Jared doesn't. No, he oh, finds please. the biggest guy. He no, finds oh, the biggest oh, guy. Oh yeah, goes like, up, goes like, against like him. when he elbowed little Zach Fulton, like a twenty-year-old, in the face and cut him it open. Didn't, it didn't. Oh my it goodness! Did not. It Crikey, did. you guys, you are you so blind. Why are you, you guys, know. me, son? <laughs> sorry, 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 Dad. Um, no, no, I. Nelson, Nelson, he, he irritates me because he is a big man who yep. plays hard. And at the moment, he's got this thing in his game where, what was I reading the other day? And I never agree with, uh, with Buzz Rothfield. Mm. But what, he's been the most cited player over the last 12 months with no weeks off. Yep. 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 Okay. It's, so it's, it's beyond a joke. So we, yep. we have to get moving. Yep. But let me, yep. let me tell you what I had a yep. problem with. You say it was a great game. It yep. was. It was. It was highly, highly... The last Intensive 10 minutes game, of defence on the line was, was absolutely sensational. I actually didn't mind the hits. Right. The niggle yep. stuff yep. drives me back. Sure. Yeah, so, sure. But I, I didn't mind the hits. But the Roosters missed 40 tackles. Mm-hmm. Yep. Defensive-wise, you say it was a great defensive game. Mm-hmm. They were lucky. And they yeah. were lucky because Melbourne were off because they had only a 76% completion rate with 47% of the game, mm. of the ball. So it wasn't that good a defensive game. But it was, and, and I've always said, a hard game like that will never be perfect. It'll, sure. it, it'll sure. always have missed tackles. It'll always have drop ball because yep. you're hitting them so hard, they sure. can't hold it. Sure. But I don't think you're right to say that it was all one way. It wasn't. Oh, but I've... you know what? Every one of them should have been picked up. You're right yep. about Munster. You're yep. right about... Yep. You're a hard grade. And I think right at the about... moment... Give you that. I think at the Nelson. moment, Nel- Nelson and Munster are protected species. That's Nel- the thing Nelson that really, definitely. really annoys yeah. me. Yeah, How agree. does Munster get away with the stuff he gets away? I've and if you idea. looked at every time he got tackled, virtually every single time he got tackled, he gets up and he goes, where's my penalty? Yeah, yeah of course. He did it a dozen times, I, I reckon. But you know what? That's becoming, it's that's that's becoming a bit of a trend. irritating. Brian, did you want to say anything more about this before we move on? No, I've said my piece. I okay. thought it was a garbage game. Raiders... <laughs> <laughs> well, speaking of garbage well, games... Well, you're not into football at the moment, so your, yeah. your opinion counts for no. nothing. Speaking of garbage games, Raiders 48, oh. Sea Eagles 6. I've got to say, I was disappointed the Raiders didn't get to 50. Oh. That, 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 I was, you were disappointed. I that's, was disappointed. That's harsh. That, no, well, that no, is very harsh. harsh. <laughs> and, that, was, and that jersey smells. Because I know, I actually, it does smell, yeah. doesn't it? It's off. Because I actually <laughs> backed the Sea Eagles for this one. Yeah, I think I might have too. And uh, I, thought, I thought the maybe. Eagles were really going to turn up. Home crowd, they're really going to put on a it show. It wasn't a home crowd, it was in Canberra. Canberra's home crowd. <laughs> <laughs> I, honestly, uh, I thought they were going to put on a show. I, I was going to say, so So I, I think I think the first 35 minutes, I, I don't think a single bounce of the ball went Manly's way. Yeah, no, I'll agree. It was, I, I have... I have and and it, and I don't believe in luck in football games. Cause I think you make your own. But I could not believe the number of things that just clicked for Canberra. Yeah. Like even uh, even one of the tries they scored, they were going to kick that ball was going eighteen meters over the dead ball line. Yeah. And uh, hit was it Kieran Foran in the knee and bounced straight back into a Raider who scored. Yeah. It was like you can't you you can't make that luck. Yeah, but you said that's what the first thirty five minutes. What about the other 50? Well, they scored 30 points points. in that 35 minutes. (laughs) (laughs) So 18 sixes are right. (laughs) Yeah. No, it was, it was terrible. Mm -hmm. They, um, yeah. So, so what do we have have to do? Uh, next year, we could get some troops back that would help. 
But it's one game to go. I mean, you know. Yeah, I'm, think... not saying, I'm saying for next no, year. I mean, I mean no. are we talking about they've got wholesale changes of the team? or? Yeah, well, well they will. If, if Like I said, there's 17 players out injured at the moment. You, you know, I don't think you're going to win games with no, that. No, you're not. But I'm saying for next year. But, but unfortunately, I don't think you still lose by 42 points and then no. go, yeah, we played well. No, you don't. All right. I, I am, but I, I will say, I am, I am, I am stressing this. Marty Tapao, Walker, Kieran Foran. I, I don't understand how we can lose those three, and now probably Ruben Garrick because yep. that that rumor. Like it Tons, started Tons, and, it, it? and it hasn't gotten and and Schuster, if the rumors are right, he wants well, out. No, he's not going anywhere. Mm. So that's that's four players on one of them on eight hundred k a year. How can they afford to buy no one? So will Des yeah. get will Des get the first eight games next year? No, Des will Des Des has got it for life. There's no one. There's no one. The, 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 this is this is the problem. There is no one else. Des doesn't have a well, it's, be, it's because it's because that it has to be a manly coach. That's the problem. Because I tell you what, yeah. Jeff Toomey mm. will be in the background saying, "No, I'm here." <coughs> no, Jeff wouldn't do that right. to him. Okay, we're going to move <coughs> on. Sharks sixteen, Bulldogs zero. Uh, yeah, I didn't really think this was much of a game, to be honest with you. Yep. I was surprised the Sharks had so much trouble to put mm. the dogs mm. away. Yeah, because it was only yep. what ten nil until about ten minutes to go. Yeah. Or something yeah. Like. yeah, it wasn't their finest. Game. Yeah, uh, the, the Sharks did what they had to do. Yeah, I think the coach said he said it, you know it wasn't a great performance, but we needed to win. And yeah. We did, which they did. You know, sometimes he's and the do dog that. showed a lot of heart. Yeah, if not much else. <laughs> yeah. Well, that's all you expect. All right, let's go to Rabbitohs twenty. Oh, I put Cowboys twenty. It should be ten. Rabbitohs twenty, Cowboys ten. <laughs> I wish. Wouldn't have mm. saved me. Wouldn't yeah. have saved you. What did you think of this game, Steve? Then we'll tell him what we thought. <laughs> I did the same to him. Oh, I thought it was a spectacular game. I loved it. Yeah. I thought the defensive hits were Get really Get your tongue out of your shit. Yeah, sorry. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Um, look, I... I was worried all the way through. Mm-hmm. Even when Souths were ahead 14-6, mm-hmm. they just found ways to keep Cowboys in the game. They, they started out going wide. And they start out going wide too quick. Mm. And all of a sudden, they're throwing balls Agreed. over the sideline. They're getting mm. them knocked down. Mm. It's like they either needed to step back a metre or two or yeah. stop trying to go wide instantly. Mm. And then they, st- they changed the game to try and go through the middle. Agreed. And they had more success. But yeah. they still weren't that great. No. I, I think their defence... Because I was expecting a lot more points from the Cowboys. I think your defence was very good. Um, I think your attack was clunky. It was. And, and, and the problem with the Rabbitohs at the moment is it's, it's amazing that they're where they are because seriously, they go in and out of games all the time. Yeah. They seem to go to sleep for half an hour, uh, for 20 minutes, and then all of a sudden somebody gets a penalty and they go, right, oh, we're on. Okay, yeah. they'll go and score a try. And that's the danger is that they'll usually make something out of their, of their opportunities yeah. when that happens, but they go in and out of games and that's going to be a concern going into the finals. Well, I don't know. Um, they're able to do it against Penrith. They, it was, mm. was what I would consider the first game they played 80 minutes. Well, so, that's the problem. They've had a game where they played yeah, eighty but, minutes, but, but they're not they doing do it consistently. It. Oh, we'll what, what do you think? What do you think about Latrell nicking off, nicking off, to, nicking off to oh, his farm? I made yeah. a comment about this today uh, on some side. I said the Roosters did the same thing with yeah, him, but I, but, but I, Ooh. and you're not going to like me, but, but I think his ego is out of control, and the Roosters, Roosters helped manage that, and I don't think, and I don't think it's, I don't think it's good. Oh, I, and I, and, and I, if I was playing in that team, I would be absolutely filthy that he puts in forty minutes a game. And, and wanders around half the game, and there he gets to go home to Tari, and they don't. I, in uh, the background, I, I reckon I'd be filthy. With that. Well, I, would, I would only say you got a bloke like Cam Murray there. Yeah. Who, who just, you know, and, and I would have to say he is, he is an exceptional player. Exceptional. Yes. He, he gives his all, and he leads by example. And you've got Luttrell, who drifts in and out of games, and he was, he was and, noticeably and, quiet last week. And I was just disappointed week. last week because he was out, caught out of position a couple of times. Yep. Yeah. And I, he was very quiet. I'm just, I'm, yeah. I'm, I'm just saying, like, I, I, I don't, I don't take it that the, you know, the team's going to be upset. But I'm thinking, if I'm a Souths fan, I want him there. Mm. I want him working, and I want him, Absolutely. I want him in 80 minutes, like, Absolutely. like Murray. Well, you're I, never going to get 80 I, minutes I want, out of I want him, plays. I want him to play for 80 minutes, just like Murray, and just bleed for my club. Somebody, somebody said on the right. radio today. If Luttrell's worth a million, Cam Murray's worth three million. And I said, yeah, I agree. 
that Seriously, right? that's how good he that's how good he is. He is yep. so so yep. so good. All There's right. a huge difference in the team when he plays and when he doesn't play. Yep, absolutely. All right, let's go on to Dragons twenty four, Tigers twenty two, and they only just won this in the oh, last couple man. of minutes. Fell for that young kid who oh, touched the ball. Oh, he has on the to know the kickoff. rules, surely. Yeah, jeez, because that was the turning point in the game. Game's I mean, locked. surely he's played more than one game of football to understand on a dropout you don't yeah, touch yeah. it in the first yeah, 10 metres. That was pretty sad. The, the Tigers just find new and exciting ways <laughs> to, to lose, lose games. They, they are the new North Sydney. Uh, they yeah. are woeful. Grabbing defeat out of the jaws of victory. Yeah, Man, yeah. they're bad. And now and now they're, they're talking about... So so I don't, I don't know how, how much you follow the you know, other clubs' news, but... They've got they've got a young the young half back there, Jock Madden. Mm. Yeah. And Tim Sheens has basically said, Well, see ya. I know. <coughs> and Sorry. I'm thinking thinking, why would you do that? Like yeah. that that kid he, can he's, play. He's not going to the Dolphins, is he? Well I thought, I thought no. he's a backup to the Dolphins. No, well, no, 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 oh, no that's okay. er, er, earlier this year. Oh, I know that, but earlier this Jock year Madden's and now. late last year, Manly were after him big time. Yeah. yeah. Uh, apparently he's been linked to every club under the sun because they're gonna keep Luke Brooks. They need to lose Luke Brooks. Yes. Let, let him have Luke a new Brooks life needs to go somewhere, somewhere else. else. He needs to go somewhere and else. And start again. Yeah, They're going to so start again anyway. They might as well start again yep. with oh, him. Yep. It just it hurts me because I think Jock Madden's a really good player. <laughs> well, the real problem with Luke Brooks is he's on a million dollars next year. So who's going to take him and get a and, and take you know some what? of his salary? Pay half his money. Pay five hundred thousand. Let someone yeah. else pay yeah. the other five hundred yeah. and still keep. Madden. They should have let him go to the Knights. It would have been you know fresh start at the Knights would have been good for him. Yeah. And so the dragons weren't that good. Is, is no, basic, they basically no. what it comes down to: the dragons yep. weren't that good, but no. the tigers found a way to lose. Yeah, yep. for sure. Titans thirty-six, Knights twenty-six. I'm not sure that anyone actually tackled in this game. Hmm. I, I, I actually I enjoyed didn't it. like it. I enjoyed it, this it, game. It, the yeah. When the do, when the titans are scoring points, they look really, really good. Oh yeah, they can't defend for oh, their yeah. life, but, but they look, really look great. But when you know what? When they still scored yeah. three tries when they were down one. Yeah, yeah. Newcastle yeah. let in three tries yeah. against twelve men. Yeah. Yeah. I tell you what, AJ Brimson's a quality player, isn't he? Oh, he's a, yeah, he's a yeah, tremendous and, player. You know, Firmer and, and Marzu, yeah. they're they're. Yeah. They've got all they're, Queenslanders. They're attacking. Terrific. They're attacking prowess. And, and is, Tino, is impressive. Yeah, and Tino. I think Fafita yeah. had his bet. Uh, well, he scored one try. You know, um, uh, he's going to be great next year with running off Kieran Foran. Let me just tell you. <laughs> well, they said, they said he'd be really good in NFL because you can you can go off the field when the when the defense is on yeah. and you can come back onto attack. I yeah. look. I think he's very much like Latrell. I, I think he goes in and out of games. Um, and tries to pick his moment, but mm. it doesn't happen that often. They they yeah. need if he ran as much as Tino did. Oh yeah, they'd, they'd be unstoppable. Yeah. Yep. You watch him next year running off um little Kieran, Kieran. Foran. Little Kieran Foran. Okay. Mahara out. Who's doing the ladder? I think it was your turn, wasn't it, Tom? I think it is. Who cares? <laughs> Football's over. All right, second last round. Uh, at the end of second last round, uh, the Panthers minor premiers forty two points. Uh, Sharks six points behind thirty six. Cowboys 34, the Storm round out the four at 32. Just outside the four, the Eels on 32. The Roosters and the Rabbitohs on 20, uh, sorry, 30, sorry. And the Raiders read it. on 28 <laughs> round out the eight. Um, the Broncos on 28, um, just fallen out of, of the eight and probably not likely to get back again. Dragons on 24, the Knights, sorry, the uh, Seagulls on 20. Bulldogs 14, Knights 14, Warriors 14. Titans twelve and the poor old Tigers who should have been should have won that game on ten points at the bottom. Should have won a few games. Yeah. Yeah. There you All go. All right. You wanna talk you guys sent me some lists of stuff you want to talk about. One of them oh, oh, talks about uh, merchants. I, I put instead of hats, I put cheap shop merchants. No, there's a few of them. I was actually thinking of um I was actually thinking this week. <clears throat> uh, if I, I wonder if I could uh, if I could make up a team of the grubbiest players I've ever seen, <laughs> how many of them would be currently playing? Mm. And I reckon there's a few of them. Mm. Oh no! Oh no! No cheap, cheap shots. Like it's not like, not like the old days are, where are if you, you belted someone, you got smacked back. Are, are you talking cheap shots or are you talking grubby McGinnis type? No, I'm talking. I'm talking cheap shots. Okay. All right. So yeah. would you call Jared a cheap shot merchant? Yep. Yeah. Oh, I don't think he is. Yeah. Yeah. yeah well, of course you don't. Yeah. 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 Him, Nas. Uh, Munster, Dylan Walker, yeah. they're just they're just those those grubby little give him an elbow, give him a kick. I, I don't I don't understand 
I don't understand how it stays in the game. See, I see. I th- I think Jared is loose. I don't think he's grubby. Oh, here we go. oh no! I think he's no. loose. I think he goes out hard, and he goes out hard, there's, and sometimes he gets it wrong. There's a very fine line. Uh, I he, think no, he's just he, loose. He, go, he goes out to hurt. He's loose. It's like Jack Hetherington. I love Jack Hetherington. I think he's a fantastic player, but he's loose. You know, no, yeah. he's just loose. There's different. Jack Hetherington, he'll he'll <laughs> clobber you high, and then go, "Oh no, what have I done?" <laughs> he's loose. That's Jar- right. Jar- Jar- Jared will clobber you high and go, "Oh, it wasn't me." Yeah, oh, yeah, exactly. sure. yeah, yeah. Yep. All right. Bias. You want to talk about? Uh, oh yeah. Look, I I actually I'm actually grade. yeah no no well, no no he, he's no, 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 no. Oh, okay look, you wanted to take it very yeah 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 okay yeah sorry yeah I'm I'm I want to I want reserve grade back you know I I miss I miss going. To the footy. Oh. oh my goodness, Stephen! This is very he's unprofessional. In yeah, he's in demand. Unprofessional? Yes. You need pause Hello, it. this is Stephen Sage speaking. I'm currently doing a radio show and unable to talk. Oh, sorry, it's Tracy. How are, hello, my wife. How are you? I'm good. How are you? Good. We're in the middle of the show. Can we call back? Yes, no worries. Thank you. I think you might be finished by now. No, 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 no. They it's made Brian's me start fault. late. It's Brian's fault. All right. Bye. <laughs> There you go. Sorry, getting back to the show. And then the oh, reserve grade. Steve's Steve's uh, lovely wife. Yes, Steve's lovely wife. Don't know how he bagged her, but anyway. Um, <laughs> aim high, son. Aim, aim high. high. <laughs> punching. He's punching. Punching. Uh, yeah. So, I, like, I used to like going to the going to uh, going to the game and watching the old guys playing in reserve grade with the young guys, and you'd be going, oh, you know. And, and, and it got me thinking about blokes like James Tamo. Yep. See, I, I think James Tamo still could probably cut it at a few clubs, but, yep. you know, regardless of that, or, or Andrew Fafida, how good would it be for the Sharks to keep Andrew Fafida, have a reserve grade team that's a legitimate Sharks reserve grade team, and go, mate, look, we just want you to captain this team and teach these young guys how to play. He's got a couple of years left in him. Yep. I don't, I don't yep. understand why we throw it away. That's fair. So point. I'm 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 yep. frustrated with that. Mm. So there you go. That's I want a legitimate reserve grade, Steve. You want a legitimate reserve. A grade. legitimate I, reserve I'm, grade. I'm looking something up for you Ooh, because you I'm looking? actually going to find you a legitimate. Oh, hang on, we'll have to go. Don't back. find me a legitimate something. I don't know what he's going to find me that's no, no. legitimate. No, no, I, I want to say I agree with you. Oh, um, okay. Because I'm, I'm feeling entirely illegitimate this entire show at the moment. And you notice he hasn't complained about the jersey for the last uh, 15 minutes? I, it's, it's making my head spin. I'm very light-headed. <laughs> I'm Do you this. remember? Yeah. What? Yellen Gordon. Yellen Gordon. Yellen Gordon. Yellen Gordon. Yeah, yeah, you yeah, yeah. You remember? Yeah. Was it he, South, South Centre? Yeah, he went, he went to South. He, he, he then oh, he was South and then he left and went a few... And your point is? Yeah. My point is he's playing reserve grade. He was 10 years wow. ago. He was a superstar. Is he still? Is he still playing? I think playing. superstar he's might be playing. pushing. Might be no, stretching. No, no, a bit. Okay. Well, he, he was he, a potential superstar. They all said he was going to be really big, and yep. he, he never really made it. Yeah. But he's actually playing like, and I'm backing you up. He's yep. playing in South Reserve Grade, and he's the captain of the they're, club. They're last, aren't they? No, Manly are last. Yeah, Manly are last. Yeah. <laughs> he, he he comes off the bench. I mean, he, yeah. look, the guys. I think he's about thirty-one or thirty-two. Yeah. Right. But that's the point. Yeah, yeah. I don't. We, I, it is already there. I just don't think it's uh, done enough. Well, it's it's not because they don't all have reserve grade side. And how the heck a manly reserve grade side at Blacktown? Yeah, I know. I know. That's, anyway, that's just silly. All right, where's your Tom, reserve you grade talk- team? Uh, North Sydney Bears. Mm, yeah. Pretty close. Oh, pretty, pretty close. close. Yeah, in manly territory. Well done. <laughs> well, you should get yourself organised. So, so, you know what you've done? You stole all their juniors. Now you're stealing all of ours. Get knotted, roosters. I hate the roosters. <laughs> oh, oh, no. Hang on. Oh, no. <laughs> it's oh. off. Hang on. Hang on. Are you complaining that their reserve grade is North Sydney Bears? You stabbed North Sydney Bears in the back. We stabbed them straight in the face, mate. Straight in the face. <laughs> All right, All right. Tell me what about yeah, so NRLW. I'm, I'm making this because I think NRLW is really coming of, coming of age. I've been invested it in, in it for the whole time. So I, the fact that my team happens to be going really well is really not the point. Get on with it. NRLW is going gangbusters. It's really going well. Okay. But you don't care. No, so, okay. So um, ladder for the, for the Women's Premiership, Roosters and Knights are the only team that have won twice. The Dragons have won... Oh, no, sorry. And the Dragons have won three times, uh, twice. 
So Roosters, Nice Dragons have won both their games. Um, Titans, Eels, and Broncos. There's a big, big disconnect between the top three and the bottom three. It's surprising to see the Broncos haven't won a game yet. Considering Minus 38 points. Premiers, Tri- the last, triple the premiers. Three years and That's then right. Last yep. grand final so Roosters are flying. Um, we played the Dragons in the grand final rematch on Friday night. Should be a cracker. I, I love watching the girls play. Seriously, I, I think the tackling is. Yeah. Is, is really, really good. And I think the quality of the, the game is getting better and better. Yeah, I've got to say, yeah. I enjoy watching it too. Yeah, it's, it's really good yeah. to watch. Yep, yeah, I agree. Yeah. Yeah. All right, gentlemen, we need to move on because we're running yeah. out of time. Eels versus Storm Thursday night. This will be an interesting game. Yeah. Storm win. Then the winner of South and the Rabbitohs can grab fifth spot right. and a home semi. Okay. Storm yep. lose. We're going to play each other the week after regardless. So that means I'll, I need to have the Storm to win. Oh. That's pretty sick. I'm on the storm to win. I'm on the storm to win as well. Uh, look, I think the Eels will win it. You do? Honestly, I do. Yeah. I, I don't Eels want to win. play the Roosters again in the semi finals. Me either. I don't want to play you either. Because I don't like you. Bulldogs versus Sea Eagles. <laughs> Go the mighty Eagles. <laughs> seriously. I think the Bulldogs are going to do you. No, 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 no. Look, look, oh, look. We, we, we had another injury during the week. <laughs> And we've, got, we've got young K.O. Weeks is now playing fullback. So, um, I, I'm, and I'm looking forward to seeing him play for a full 80 minutes. No, I'm right. sorry. That's it. That's all I've got. The Bulldogs are going to smash you. Well, I don't know if it's smash, but they'll win comfortably, no, I think. It'll be... Well, okay. I'm going to say 16 points. Okay. Oh, no, that's please. a smashing. Okay. All right. Well, you're going Reese's, you're going Rabbitohs. This is the blockbuster of the season. New stadium. Yeah. We're all uh, going to go. The I, most, I don't think we should be playing there. I think. The, the most boring game of the season because <laughs> no one really cares. Uh, the Roosters versus Rabbitohs. Now, should be an absolute cracker. Uh, I'll, I'll tell you this right now. I think that Souths are a disjointed unit and I don't think that the Roosters know how to tackle. So this is going to be boring. <laughs> <laughs> but given the jumper you are wearing, who's going to win? The Roosters. <laughs> Given See, the jumper you're wearing, that's vengeance. I, I think no, no. I, I think there's too many cracks in the South team. I think I think letting Latrell wander off to do whatever uh, after after really bad performance. It's you, I, you I know, know he'll, I he'll come out and fire. You know no what I fear that. here? We're at Hargraves taking out Mitchell. That's what that's oh, what I fear. He'd never happen. do that. He's not a cheap shop merchant. No, he know. is. We know that. Well, I I fear I fear them <laughs> getting suspended because of doing stupid stuff because they so do I. they got sucked in last time we played. Yep. Um, and so hopefully there's been a lot of talk about that so that that doesn't happen. And look, the Roosters will be wanting to win. Look, the Rabbitohs will be wanting to win and say, ha, 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 first game at the new stadium, we beat you. No. And the Roosters will be saying, it's our home, we want to win. Yeah. So, you know, there's, and, and the other point is, when the Rabbitohs play the Roosters, the, the, the playbook and, the, and the, uh, the form book goes completely out the window. I know. I so. remember 60 to 6. Oh. It was 8, thanks. 60 to 8. Yeah. Warriors and Titans. Uh, Titans. I think the Warriors, like Manly, they just pack I up. I think the Warriors up. are going to do this one. Oh, and it was sixty-two nil in ninety-five. So just blah blah blah. Okay. Well, if you're gonna if you're gonna pull up old statistics, I'll tell you too. Ninety-five. Yep, Seriously, doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. We're talking ninety-five. And you're talking about two years ago, so it's old history. Yeah, I'm talking about the last five games. It's it's Steve only actually yeah. Steve should appreciate that because it's, his team is all about history. They got yeah, nothing right. current. Their history. Yeah. Excuse um, me, when was the last time Manly won a grand final? That's irrelevant to this conversation. <laughs> uh, t- Titans for me. Uh, Warriors for me. Okay. Uh, Dragons and Broncos. Drags. Um, oh, I'm going the the, to give the Broncos some hope of trying to at least, uh, of being humiliated and, and, and no. getting some pride back. No, they've got nothing. The Broncos have to win this They've one. got nothing. All right. They've been woeful. The Dragons were terrible last week too. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> they only won because... because the Tigers found a way to lose. I, th- I don't think the drunk the Broncos. I don't think the Broncos can win. Okay. All right. Uh, Cowboys and Panthers. All well, right. Cowboys and reserve grade Panthers. Yes. It's seriously ten, a reserve grade. No, no, no. I want to hit Charlie Staines, Suana Tavala, Robert Jennings, Thomas Jenkins. Never heard of him. Christian Crichton, Kurt Fall, Sean O'Sullivan, Lindsay Smith, Mitch Kenny, Matt Eisenhuth, Chris Smith, Scott Sorensen, Jermaine Hopgood. They've got a half a te- half a team there. Who? Yeah, it's the Soren- Sorensen. Um, Smith's played first grade. Uh, yeah, the halves. A, a, a bunch of them have played first yeah. grade. Yeah, but, no, but it's, it's to it's be perfectly honest, team. there is not a single first grade player and there. Not that we bet, but the 
the the, the betting odds are one a dollar fifteen for Cowboys, five dollars fifty for Panthers. When was the last time Panthers were five dollars fifty? And I'm still picking the Panthers. No, I picked the Cowboys. I'll go the Cowboys. It's at home. The Cowboys, Cowboys at home. home. I'm yeah. still going the Panthers. Well, they've got a lot. They got a lot to play for the Cowboys. Knights and Sharks. Nice. Oh, sorry, Sharks. Oh, sorry, Sharks. Sorry. <laughs> what am I saying? Sharks. <coughs> Sharks. Jeez, you had while. to think about that. Yeah, yeah, because oh, wow. because I've got a feeling that if results go Sharks and Raiders' way, yep, they'll just dump a whole bunch of players out and rest them. Yep. So I'm 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 saying Sharks, but I I think it'll be tight because there's nothing to play for, and they'll just okay. Yeah, Tigers and Raiders. Raiders are winners. See, I think the Raiders will do the same. I'm tempted to go to the Tigers. Tight, but, but the Raiders aren't Raiders, safe. Raiders need to win. They're not safe. No, because the Broncos are going to lose. Well, Raiders, the Raiders won't be banking on that. See, if the Bron- but if the Broncos lose, yeah. I guarantee you there'll be a whole bunch of injuries come out of Canberra. And yeah, they'll, they'll rest them. You mean they'll rest them for week one of the finals? No, they'll rest them this week. Rest them this week. Broncos, they're, they're Broncos they're go down, they've, they've got nothing. They, yeah. they don't hang, on, hang on, I don't understand. This is week 25. Yes. The Broncos lose this week, yeah. then it's the finals after that. Yeah. No, no, it's what it what Oh, I say because the Raiders play after the Raiders Broncos. Play Sorry. After. So, gotcha. Gotcha. so the Raiders will okay. rest. But you know that. what? The same could happen yep. with yep. Roosters and Souths. The, well, there's, there's, sudden, talk, about resting there's but, talk about that too. But they won't because, because that's a traditional rivalry. And, and because, like you, I don't think either team wants to play each other the next, next week. No. Although we know what happened last time that happened. And but I'd no, be happy but to it only means and one of us have. The well, Rabbitohs won the first game. We won the second one. <sighs> the one that mattered. All right, footy tips. So one week to go in our. Well, I've, I've remembered to put mine in this week. Did you? Oh, that's yeah. good. Oh, so that. So Brighton seventy five is on top with three hundred points. And St Mick, Arsado, Mick Roosters, Keenaz, Gordon Scott, Bronco for life, Chooks Rule, Penny Proud, oh, and Amigo Panthero. Brian, you are coming. Stone. Let's say Rebels. last. Yeah. Because Lobster hasn't put a yeah, tip I, in. I haven't put my tips in the last three weeks either, but don't worry about that. I think it was three weeks. Yeah, it has been. You have plummeted. Yeah. I, season finished six weeks ago. Women in league round. <laughs> yeah, I didn't know it was that other round. Yeah. It was lit women in league yeah, round. And we do have to congratulate. Oh, yes. Whoa. For winning the grand final of our super coach. What does he get? What does he get? He gets a hearty congratulations I from like that. the three of us. Okay, right. Ha ha! Hearty! Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you ripped off, ripped off well. And, and Absolutely gets to, ripped off. And he gets to keep that congratulations all 12 months. Oh my goodness. So this I, time I, next year. Walt introduced me to Supercoach. And so... It's been yeah. that he won. Well, I, yeah. I've got to anyway. say, it was very close. He only won by three points. <laughs> I know. So is that good? Three points. That's very, very close. That's okay, very right. close. Okay. Three, so point, three points like is monster one... running another five metres. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. That's enough of information for me. Yeah. He's got We're no gonna idea. Get... He's got no Don't idea. Thank you. All right. So All congratulations, right. Wall. And that's it. Oh, Gentlemen, that's... we've gone well over. Can't <laughs> wait. Show's over. Oh. <laughs> Do not touch me, okay? Whew. Oh, yeah. sorry. We're not finished I, yet. I yeah. haven't signed off yet. Oh, sorry. Put it back on. I'm not putting it back on. <laughs> anything, in te- anything intelligent you want in the show? Well, be intelligent now. You've taken oh, it off. I know. I feel like I'm regaining brain cells as we speak. <laughs> Your teeth have sort of realigned themselves. Too. <laughs> anything you want in the show with? Come on, we're well over time. Go, Manly. Go, Manly. Surely we can beat the dogs. We can't finish worse than 11. We can't Tom, finish worse than 11. You know, anyway. The roosters smash those rabbits. Okay. Then I'll say it. Enjoy the show. We'll see you all next week. Bye-bye. See ya.